the drivetrain. The drivetrain gives your robotic invention the ability to move. It comes in different forms, but in this example, we will use the Clawbot IQ base. Let's get started. Open the ModKit for VEX editor. Drag a drivetrain onto the screen. Assign the same port as you will on the physical VEX IQ brain. You can change the settings to match your drivetrain. We'll use the default in this example. Click on the Blocks tab and make sure you're editing the drivetrain. Drag a When block and a Forever block onto the screen. Place a Drive Forward 25mm block and set the distance to 100mm. Drag a Turn Left 45 degrees block and set the angle to 180 degrees. Lastly, drag a Stop block onto the screen. Download your program. Run your program. Note that the turn may not be a perfect 180 degrees due to friction. Look up Turning Scrub to learn more. Next, let's modify the program to control the turning speed and drive speed of the drivetrain. Place the turn and drive speed setup blocks underneath the when start block but outside of the forever loop. This location ensures that the setup blocks are run only once each time your program runs. Set the values of both speeds to 20%. Download your program and run it. Observe how the drivetrain moves slower and turns slower than before because of the setup blocks. In this tutorial, you learned about the drivetrain and programmed it to drive forward and turn. There's so much more that you can do. Visit help.modkit.com for more tutorials and ideas.